Here in the ESPN Sports Science Lab, draft prospects will be graded based on data collected from our position-specific tests. Next up, Wisconsin running back, Monte Ball. To test this year's most promising ball carriers, we put them through our Game Changer test. Here we go. Three, two, one. heavy bag car wash in just over two seconds, the second fastest time we recorded for running backs this year. He stiff arms the dummy with more than 1,500 pounds of force. That's more than stiff arms we measured from sports science alum, Adrian Peterson. And Monte finishes our test with an incredible display of power. With his 16.8 inch calves, nearly five inches larger than the circumference of a softball, Monte launches off the ground with about 1,400 pounds of force. This generates enough power to launch his 212 pound frame over a 5'9 high bar into the end zone. So to really put this powerful lower body to the test, we put Monte through our work test, where he has to drag 150 pounds of dead weight 10 yards. If I move a weight a certain distance, I'm gonna create a certain amount of work. When we start looking at how fast I do that, that's power. So some athletes are able to generate more power than others. All told, during this test, Monte generates nearly 1,700 watts of power. And he reacts and covers 10 yards in just 2.79 seconds. That's the fastest time we recorded for any running back, linebacker, or tight end this year. So when we crunch the numbers, Monte Ball scores an 87.8 on our metric slotting him higher than sports science alumni Ryan Matthews and LeGarrett Blunt. One thing NFL teams won't have to worry about is Monte Ball's durability. In his senior season, he had more rushing attempts than any player in the NFL last year, even though ball season was two games shorter. For ESPN Sports Science, I'm John Brinkus.